Hi everyone and welcome back to another video on the channel. Thank you so very much for all the support you have given me over the past few months of creating this channel and starting this journey together. It's very, very hard work and a lot of effort goes into the video. So please continue to support the channel. Please like the videos and subscribe and share it as well. I really, really do appreciate it and it is one of the things that keeps me going. Um, this video is just a different video again. I'm just going to give you another update on me really. Because um, a lot has changed in a few days since the last video I put out there about my update. So I'm just going to get straight into it really, just get on with it. Um, my mental health has took a turn for the worst again. Um, I like to just be honest and share this with you guys because I know that a lot of people suffer out there as well. And if I can share my experience, I hope it will help people speak up about theirs as well. And I'm always there for you all as well. And even though I'm down and suffering at the moment, then doesn't mean I'm not going to help anyone else or be there for anyone else. Just want you all to know that. But my mental health has took a turn for the worst. I feel so anxious. I can't stop feeling anxious about things. It has actually prevented me from getting out and doing what I want to do. Um, what I want to do when I want to do it. I told you I went to a, got into a gym. I started going regularly, to be honest. It just stopped because of my anxiety. Thinking that I'm not able to do things that people are going to be there that I don't want to see. Overthinking things and it's just horrible. It's a horrible feeling to have. And it's difficult to describe because if I could describe it, I would explain it to you, but it's so, so difficult to describe when you're feeling that way because you don't have the feeling of anything else. And then my low mood kicks in and it's just like a kick, kick in the teeth, really. It's a sucker punch when my low mood kicks in and then my anxiety gets worse and my depression and the thoughts change and stuff like that. I start feeling worthless and not good enough. And it's just really, really difficult at times. And I like to share it on my channel. Not because I want sympathy. That's not what it is. I want to raise awareness of mental health and anxiety and stuff like that. Because it's so prominent nowadays. Especially when we've come out of the pandemic rising prices, more stresses in life, more people are going to suffer with it, but don't speak out about it. So I see it as very important, not just video in a video about it. Um, but it also helps me to talk about it. If I put it out there, it helps me feel that little bit better. And I hope with me talking about it, it helps you guys as well, who watch this video and are going through similar things that speaking out isn't a bad thing um speaking out doesn't show weakness it shows strength that you're able to talk about how you feel and that you're able to not bottle it up because nowadays people think especially in men i think that if you cry it's a weakness men shouldn't cry you've just got to get on with it be the stronger and better person but we all go so through something in our lives where bottling it up isn't the answer isn't the solution to things and i think nowadays mental health is so prominent in people that we just need to talk we need to find time to talk to people and find them people that we can trust to talk to and that's the first step in being able to help each other and help society in, in general because there's this stigma now that if you've got mental health that you're weak and 
Um, and there's something wrong with you, but there's nothing genuinely wrong with you. It's an illness. No one chooses to have depression and anxiety and low mood, etc. No one chooses to have it. No one wants it. Everyone wants to be happy in their own way. But it's just the pressures of life, the pressures of family and stuff like that. And everything gets on top of you and it does change you. It can make you a stronger and better person inside, but also make you very vulnerable as well. And people can take that vulnerability for granted and use you and mess you around and think that you are good enough. So you make them feel special and they make you feel special and then leave you and hurt you and use you as I've said and mess you around and that makes you even worse and that's what people do nowadays not everyone but it's what some people do they take the vulnerability and exploit that take that vulnerability and that weakness out of you and go for it whereas they don't see the positives and the strengths in people they take their weaknesses and vulnerabilities and take advantage of you and that's not everyone, it's the fine minority, but um, mental health is a very important topic for me. And yes, I suffer with it. Anxiety as well. And it helps me feel a little bit better and calmer when I can talk about it on a video. Not because I want views or likes or anything like that. Just because it's a platform where I can share my story and share how I feel. And hopefully it'll help you guys as well. Um to share and open up and talk to people that you trust and as i said i'm always here if you need me i will leave my socials in the description of this video and there are plenty of helplines out there as well um that can help you counseling and stuff like that play people you can go and talk to professionally your gp and stuff the hospital there is plenty of options out there for you so don't be afraid don't be scared of bottling it up because people really want to help you and there are kind people out there um another update on my life uh the football season's over isn't it so there's going to be a lot more time for different kind of content on this video on this channel sorry um I'm going to try and bring you more behind the scenes of what I do in my day-to-day -day life, like my work environment and stuff like that. Once the football season arrives again and starts again, I will try and bring you some more football content. I will be going back to watch Berry this year, so I will bring you some content from Gig Lane and promote my football team, my hometown team, and hopefully we can get back on the rise again to the football league where we belong um i do feel better though for talking about it on this channel um i was a little bit down and anxious this morning but having spoken about it i feel a lot more brighter now i feel like i can go and enjoy my day a little bit more and hopefully i can make a difference to you guys lives the people that suffer with it as well because i don't want you to suffer alone i'm here for you you've got people with you and just remember, you're not alone. You've got people that like you, love you, want to be there for you. And I've had to realise that myself in the past, that there are people there for me, that care about me, but I try and push them away. And I just see it as, why do you do it? Why do you push people away that want to be there for you and be your support? And I have lost people in the past because of it, but people have stuck with me and I've seen the benefits of it. So just remember that we're all here for each other. We're a community on this channel. We are growing very, very slowly, but I will continue to bring you the content that you guys really want. Um, message me on any of my socials if you need me and please message me any video or ideas you want on this channel as well that I will ease, that I can bring for you guys that's not a problem so please remember to like subscribe and share the channel please so we can go on this journey together i will catch you in the next video